Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am bringing you a unique combination that's going to warm your taste buds. I've got a refreshing drink and a savory dish on the menu. So stay tuned to discover the deliciousness. So what are we waiting for? Let's crack on with it. Our first dish is Mata Kima Minced Meat Simmered in Spices and Green Peas. This is going to be a burst of flavours. The pan is really hot. Let's add some olive oil to this. Now let's add the whole spices. One bay leaf and jeera. Half a teaspoon, cinnamon sticks, your cloves and few cardamoms. Let's add two chopped onions. Let's saute this finely chopped onions to light golden brown. Let's add some salt to caramelize these beautiful onions. The onions have turned golden brown. Now is the star ingredient, minced meat. Now here's the trick. Take one fourth cup of milk, add this to the minced meat. Give it a mix and chop them into the pan. Now if you look at it carefully, Slowly the water will start coming out of the meat. You have to cook them till it evaporates. So make sure to cook the meat on high flame for 5 minutes. Let's add some salt. Now at this point you have to add 1 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste. The smell of ginger garlic paste is just amazing. The aroma is just brilliant. Let's add one teaspoon or one and a half teaspoon. If you like more spice, then add one and a half teaspoon of chili powder, one and a half teaspoon of coriander powder, one four teaspoon of turmeric powder, half teaspoon of red chili flakes, one teaspoon of cumin powder, a pinch of salt. So let's saute all these powders and ginger garlic paste nicely. This is tomato paste. I'm going to add some. And I'm also going to add two ground tomatoes. In case if you don't have the tomato paste, you can completely skip that process. Now let's add half a cup of green peas. Let's add half a cup of water to this. Let's cover and cook them on low flame for about 7 to 10 minutes. Ooh, this looks so yummy. I love the color. It smells really good. Let's add half a teaspoon of garam masala, some green chilies. Now the secret ingredient is this pure ghee. Our delicious mutter keema is ready to be savoured. For the sweltering heat, let's make watermelon citrus sunshine. Let's cut this watermelon quickly. Let's 
Let's squeeze some orange juice now. I'm adding in sugar here. For healthier option, you can add honey as well. Thanks for tuning in folks, the citrus watermelon juice and the mutter keema will surely delight your taste buds. I hope you enjoyed cooking with me. May these recipes add joy and flavour to your table. And don't forget to hit that like button. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye.